Draco made the beat not. So today we're gonna be making some cinematic trap. So without further ado, ado, a d o. Anyways, let's just get into it. I got these strings right now. You know what I'm saying? Beautiful. All right. So I'm gonna show you guys this trick again. Hit this step editing. I can't talk today. Hit this step editing mode like this. Make sure it's on beat. Click in here. And if you know how to play piano or whatever, I know the keys that you're pushing. Um, this will work well for you. But here we go. I'm just going to keep going. All right. So this is what we got. So now watch this. This is going to give it more energy. I'm going to hit control A. I'm going to hold alt. And then I'm going to left click on this arrow and drag this to five. So now we got this energy out of nowhere. So now I'm going to play with the melody a little bit more. This to create some more suspense. I don't know. And what I'm doing now is just highlighting these and then you can push control and then the up area to obviously go up an octave now i'm gonna go up a few semitones um one two three four all right so i like that so what i'm gonna go ahead and do now is go to song mode put this in here oops not that right click here replace and render Render and replace tomato, tomato. So now we got this beautiful piece of art called strings. All right, so now let's add some 808s to this piece. Variety. 
it's on stretch mode and I think it's in the key of D sharp if I remember correctly. And there it is. All right, now I got this other sound pack, which is called La Cremosa Choir. And it is by far one of the hardest choir packs I've ever heard. Um, I think it's about 400 and something dollars. Um, but yeah, it's worth it. Um, let me see if I can find it. But yeah, cinematic trap. So here is the finale of the beat, um, the final finale, the final countdown, the final, just, just listen. Biko made the beat not. That's it. Thanks for watching.